Hello students. Welcome to the series of experiments in physics presented by Mobile Science Lab. In today's session, I am going to show you a very interesting experiment to prove the Lenz law. To perform this experiment, we need few apparatus. They are aluminum pipe, these are powerful neodymium magnets, this is the copper cylinder. Now, we will have to test with the different materials and see the effect here. The lens law can be defined as whenever a magnet is allowed to fall freely in a current carrying conductor, which is not a magnetic one, that means the material which we are taking should not be a magnetic material. Aluminum, copper are such materials. Now, when a magnet is allowed to fall through these tubes, the change in magnetic flux induces EMF. That induced EMF in turn will cause some current and this current also will induce some induced magnetic field. This magnetic field induced will oppose the change which is taking place. That means, it will the induced field will be always opposite to the process which is making it. Now, to begin with, I am taking this copper cylinder, leaving it in air. When I observe it, it just falls under the gravity. When the same process is repeated in the aluminum tube, you can see that there is no difference between the rate of falling here and also in the tube. Now, let us change the material. That means, I am using the magnets. Now, I am making magnets to go through this pipe. When I do it, you observe something different. What do you observe? Do you observe that the rate of fall, rather the speed at which it is falling towards the ground will be the same? Is it? <laughs> then let us see whether it is going to be the same or not. Now, when I leave it here, you can see that. See now, should I do it? Yes. Is it the same? By chance, is that falling rate is the same or different? It is definitely much slower than what it was earlier. Now, I am adding two more neodymium pieces to this, so that the magnetic flux, the field strength is increased and then I am leaving, I am repeating this, this experiment. When I do it, you can see that. It is further decreased, the time has, it has taken more time. This way, we can prove Lenz law. The Lenz law is the change in magnetic field induces 
the EMF. It is called induced EMF. Induced EMF also will induce some field which is opposite and that opposes the change which is producing it. So, have you enjoyed it? See, you would expect that the body will be falling as usual, but it is not the case because this is simply because the magnet when it is traveling through the tube induces some voltage. Whenever there is a voltage or current, magnetic field is also associated with that. Because of that, the transit time has been increased sufficiently. I hope you have enjoyed this experiment. Thank you very much.